yeah. you got, what'd you say, something like 60 kids in that room. I mean, a huge, huge yeah. roster. Yeah. Obviously, D Division Three has different rules than D1 now where they're talking about paring it down. Not sure if that's actually going to go through or not. Right. But you got a different environment in D3. Right, no scholarships here. Not zero. Right, zero scholarships. So you got you got kids cranking in there that are wanting to crack the lineup, and they got to pay their dues, don't they? They do. Uh, yeah. So like I was telling you again, um, you know, we have a we have a squad that you know our 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 second guy, and I don't like calling him our second guy because we do a lot of splitting our teams up and bringing one team in this direction, bringing another team in the other direction. And I tell all my guys, I said, listen, you're going to be wrestling the best guys in the country. Some of you are going to be wrestling the best guys in the country in this place, and others are going to be wrestling the best in that, this place. Your job is to do what you do in practice every day. You go with the best guys in the room every day. So we expect, we expect big things from you. We expect you to win. We expect you, if, if you do lose, you learn from that loss and, and get back on it. We go over why you lost and how we can improve. And, um, you know, our, our guys, when they come here, regardless if you're the first string guy or the fifth string guy, if you win, you know, if you go to a tournament, don't go 0-2, but you go to a tournament and you get a few wins and a couple losses, you're going to get 30 matches. So regardless of where you are, you're getting 30 matches, and we make sure of that.